jump on it. I'm not sure how to play this beautiful song of One More Hallelujah by Grimley Brown. This is quite a nice song that uh, was uh, released a uh, few months ago, so I just felt like I should do a lesson on it because I've been listening to it and uh, it was such a beautiful song and I just wanted to uh, show you how to play it in your acoustic guitar. It's quite an easy song, it just has, uh, I think, three chords that you just need to know, that uh, the main code you need to know. I'm gonna show you uh, those codes and even uh, the small finger style I used for this song. Um, you can also um, try and check this song on YouTube if you want to. I'll put the link of uh, her channel because um, she has a channel. I'll put the link and so that you can listen to the song, uh, like the whole song if you want to. So, before we start, I would like you to subscribe to my channel, to like, to comment, to share, even remember to click on the bell so that you don't miss anything when I upload a new video. So let's get into it. Alright, let's get started for today's lesson. The song is quite easy and it was played in the key of A sharp major. So, which is here, this is our A sharp major. So, I'm using my capo on my third fret 
uh, normally I should play a barcode but since I'm using a capo I'll use the G shape so this is our first code the G major but normally it's a A sharp major but since I'm using a capo all the code I'm gonna uh, put here we're gonna assume it's like a G uh, we're gonna assume this one like a C and then this one also like an E uh, minor. So the first chord is right here, our G. This is our common chord, my middle, up, and then my index. And then down here, I put my ring and my pinky. That's my G major chord. Easy chord to play because it's an open chord. And then I'm playing also my C major. So you just take your index and your middle down. You have your C major. So your pinky and your ring remains at the same place. So only these two are moving. And then there is also a E minor. You can move your capo for a better sound. So I'm playing my E minor this way here. Again, my index and my middle are moving and they are going in the same fret. But my ring and my pinky remains at the same place. And then I'm playing also uh, a D over F sharp. So you have your D this way here. So you just change your fingers. Your index goes up here. And then your uh, middle on your third string. And then uh, your ring on your second string third fret that's our D over F sharp so that's uh, the code I used for this song the song is quite easy so this is our G but now for this particular song I will not use my pinky I'm staying right here I'm playing my first, sorry, my last string, and then uh, I'm not playing uh, my fifth. I'm playing right here, my fourth, my third, and my second. So you can play it like this. So this is our G, but I'm removing my index and my pinky. If you want, you can still play the whole chord if you want to. And then I'm playing something like this. So I'm playing my C. This is our C. But again, I'm not playing my pinky. So I'm playing something like this. here and then here so you pull in first so again let's do it so this is how I play it and then you play again string and then when you go to your E minor again I'm not playing my pinky and then my D over F sharp I'm not playing again my pinky
place like this you play it open E and then you play uh, this one your A and then your G or your A sharp so on my right hand quite easy also Second one, you C, and then third one, uh, your D over F sharp, and then the fourth, your E minor. So with uh, this chord, you can be able to play this song. That's quite easy. So let me back it up from the beginning, and then enjoy yourself. Until then, Lord, we're all just looking for one more. Hallelujah.